Oh, he irritates me. I don't like how he was just in the corner with his. Who do you think you are? <laughs> hey y'all, it's Joris. Oh. Mukbang. You guys don't tell anyone, but I wore this outfit in a video that I uploaded like a month ago. I don't even know when I uploaded it because I just filmed it. <laughs> but don't tell anyone though. I found this channel, Elum. El. Illumia. <laughs> I feel stupid. I found this channel called Alumniably. Alumniably? Illumiably? And they posted a video. They have a lot of videos where they post stories and I'm pretty sure, you know, they're trying to teach you some good good old life lessons. Let's look at their description. Let's see what they got for us. Illumiably has one goal, to spread positivity around the world. By sharing our videos, you are joining us on a mission to make the world a better place. Oh, I am glad I'm reacting. I always love to make the world a better place. So, let's react. This video is called Scary X Moves Next Door. What happens next is shocking. Wow. Okay, let's begin. I finally found you. Oh. You have been trying to hide from me for so long, but you didn't even know that you were public on Instagram. It's been three years since you broke up with me. <gasps> I know where you live, Jenny, and I've missed you. Oh, that's terrifying. Hey, I'm home. Oh, he gonna kill you. So good to see you. Mm -mm. You too. I'm so glad you're home, babe. So good to be home, sweetie. Work's been absolutely- Ah, the eyes are red. Bonkers. This last week. Look at the beautiful garden. I've been putting in a lot of work. Does it look pretty? No! Great job. But if I can be honest, it's not as easy on the eyes as you. Oh, that was so that was sweet. So Thought you'd never ask. Okay. <laughs> Barely even fit his head. Big head. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> How could you, Jenny? Who was that? You already forgot about me? Yeah. Slam your hand on that tree. Uh, what we had was real. I can't believe you. But don't worry, we'll be reunited again. I promise you. And I will be a better guy this time. You look like you haven't slept in a couple of days, sir. Eyes are red. I can feel the anger and jealousy in your pores. Take a nap, baby. Go ahead and take a nap. So, I uh, got news. I kind of need to go on a work conference, so I'll be out of town for a day. Babe, I was looking forward to us spending time together. Ugh, this sucks. I know. And it's almost our two year anniversary. I know this sucks, but I'm really sorry. Listen up, I'm thinking. After all of this, we go take a mini vacation. Yeah, we'll go to Napa or Paso de Robles. It'll be you, me, quality time and and you and your casket at your funeral because her ex is about to kill you we're gonna put a pause on that hey guys sorry i had to interrupt you there doors but i just wanted to let you guys know that today's video is sponsored by Sandbird. i'm gonna I love to smell good, and I know you love to smell good because all the citizens smell very good. I smell every single one of you guys, and I know you all smell good. I started using Scentbird like one or two years ago. I was actually gifted a yearly subscription. Honestly, one of the best gifts I've received. So if you want to also give someone a subscription of Scentbird as a gift, I highly recommend. If you don't believe me, I literally have an entire bag. Honestly, this isn't even half because some of it I gave to my mom. The other ones I finished the bottle, so I just don't even have it anymore. The Scentbird, me and you, we've been like this. For a while now. I even bought a perfume because of Sunbird. It was kind of expensive and I was worried to spend full price on a perfume. So I started with the sample size from Sunbird. And I was like, okay, yeah, this is it. So I bought the full bottle. This is Kirke by Tizania Terenzi with top notes passion fruit, raspberry, pear, peach, cassis, and sand. So the new fragrances that Sunbird sent me is Juicy Couture by Juicy Couture with top notes tuberose, silly, caramel, watermelon, vanilla, and that's it. <laughs> I've already used a little bit of it because I love it personally. The next one is Missoni by Missoni with top notes bergamot, Italian bergamot, dewy rose, amber, and magnolia. And then lastly, Lust in Paradise by Ex Nilio with top notes pink pepper, white peony, lychee, white cedarwood, and musk. Oh my 
I've already used some of this too. It smells really good. Sembird has perfumes, colognes, and a lot of unisex options. They also have over 600 designer brands to choose from like Gucci or Versace. The full size for a lot of these brands can cost over $150, $300, sometimes even $500. But if a full size bottle is way too much for you to commit to, have no fear, Sembird is here. They're a fragrance subscription service that allows you to try a 30 day supply of a new designer fragrance or maybe more than one for only $17 a month. The vowels are perfectly sized and they can fit into your purse, your pocket, or even your carry-on if you're traveling. Now, if you want to give Sembra a try, make sure to click the link in the description box below or use a QR code and use my code DORA6CHI for 55% off your first month. It's literally like $8 for your first month. Once again, thank you Sembra for sponsoring this video and allowing us all to smell delightful. But that's enough from me. Let's get back to the video. Doris, take it away. And our favorite bottle of wine. Wait, that sounds perfect! I love that idea! The spin was so sounds unnecessary. Great. I'll go ahead and make some reservations then. Okay, make sure you go pack, and I'm gonna go change for a run. Okay. I'll go ahead and make food while you're out. Okay, sounds good. Cool. Okay, love you, babe. Love you too, pumpkin. Ew. I don't wanna hear all that. Oh, y'all are annoying. Okay. X, come, come here. Kill them all. <laughs> okay, bye, babe. I'm going on my run. Have a great month, sweetie. You unlock the door? Mmm. Rookie mistake. Jenny! Wait! Where are you going in a rush? What does it look like, and stupid? you to lock your doors. How do you know? You really need to be more careful. This is how strangers can get into the house, Jenny. Mmm. You would know. If you're going for a run, I guess some things haven't changed. Oh my goodness! Are you okay? Look at the way, the way, the way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, I need to go back. Oh my goodness! Swung every morsel of his body in a circle. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, it's okay. No worries. Jason? What are you doing here, Jenny? Oh, I didn't know you lived in this neighborhood. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, I. Moved here a while ago. Uh, how about you? Yeah, I just moved here actually. It's a beautiful place. Yeah. Wow, small world. Uh, how are you? I mean, I know we ended things pretty intensely and I'm really sorry about that, but you know, it was three years ago. Don't even worry about it, Jenny. I'm, I'm doing good and I'm glad that I ran into I like the cinematic shot. This is a nice touch. Um, maybe, uh, you should meet my boyfriend, Zach. Oh. No, that's a lot of damn. Um, Zach. Yeah, yeah, I'd love to. I know about uh, Zach. Tomorrow? Or he my yeah. wallpaper. Uh, it's, tomorrow's not the best. He's about to leave for a business trip, but uh, I'll let you know. Um, okay. I gotta get going now, but uh, take care, Jason. Take care. After all of these years, and you're still so open about everything. <laughs> Why would you tell your ex-boyfriend that your current boyfriend will be out of town? Maybe it's because she doesn't think you're a little psychotic, you know? We, she has no idea that, you know, you have a few screws loose. Just a couple. And she used to have a relationship with you, so she probably thinks you're a normal person. Honestly, I don't really see how that's possible because when you date someone, you get hints as to whether this person is normal. So I'm sure she probably saw the signs. Who knows if she ignored them? Obviously, she got out of that relationship for her own reasons. But let's let's see where this goes. Let's see where it goes. It's almost like you want me. Mm-mm. And Zach. Zach seems like a pretentious tool, in my opinion. I'm glad you added my opinion I because it is your opinion. To realize that now. Mm, that's smooth. Baby, you won't guess who I ran into. Hold that thought. Check it out. I made us our favorite drinks and your favorite banana nut muffins. I feel like he forgot his line for a second. And your favorite banana nut muffins. You see the way muffins. Okay, I'm overanalyzing. But first off, she went for a whole job. All you did was pour in some juice in a wine glass and got these store bought, cause those were not, you did not make those. Store bought small versions of the muffins. You don't love her for real. You don't. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Where am I? This is amazing, thank you! I tried. No, you didn't try! Who was it you said you ran into? My ex-boyfriend, Jason. What? Yeah, I just ran into him in the park. It's been three years. It wasn't weird or anything, was it? You know, weirdly not. He was mature and nice, and I guess we both 
just put the past behind us. Little does she know. <laughs> I think he lives in the neighborhood. That's a coincidence. Considering that I didn't even get a notification that we got new neighbors. I'm on the app that tells us when... Okay, Zach. The neighborhood. He's intuitive. He's still in the process of moving. Um, but regardless, I'm glad he's doing good. Yeah. Good for Jason. Anyways, enough about him. Come on, let's watch a movie. Sounds good. <laughs> With these store-bought muffins and ta uh, Tampico juice. Yeah. I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you too. I won't have my drinking buddy. <laughs> Cheers. <gasps> Zach! We finally meet. You Bro, you are a creep! Benny would be into. But I was wrong. Clearly. But wow. I can't believe you, Jenny. Watching our favorite channel with your new guy. <laughs> Luckily, he's leaving tomorrow. Maybe you'll be able to find- Turn around! I mean, you are the reason I moved here. Oh, so he actually did move here. Okay. Or moved there. <laughs> this dude is scared. Henderson, 29 years old, lives in New York. New York? Ooh. What is he doing here? Relationship status. Complicated. Ooh. Ooh. This, this can't be good. Ooh, Zach, you know what you gotta do. I'm late! Mm. Babe, I'm late! Ow! Oh. Oh. Did you pack? Uh, yeah, I packed last night. Imagine he's in the shower and he like comes out, Zach, I'm gonna kill you. Thanks, love. Gotta get going, though. Yeah, let's get you there. Uh, off we go. <laughs> Bye, babe. Bye. Baby B. Text me when you get there, okay? Love you. I will. I love you, too. Uh, finally. You're gone. Where Zach. are you hiding? And like always, I have no confidence that Jenny locked her door. <sighs> These are beautiful. I Did she wait. just smell those fake flowers? Girl, <laughs> you know those are not real. It was real to me. <sighs> These are beautiful. I can't believe Zach had these delivered. <sighs> oh, so sweet. I love him. Ew, he irritates me. I don't like how he was just in the corner with his... Who do you think you are? <laughs> You're weird. Bro. Again? This wasn't from Zach. You know who it's from, just think a little harder. You're stupid. Oh my gosh! Girl, lock the doors and get the gun. <laughs> no way. I must be hallucinating. There's no way it's Jason. I moved here for a fresh start. And then I just run into him, do you what? And then I just start seeing these gifts on my front porch! Oh my gosh, I gotta call Zach! Alright, you're fogging up the lens. Relax. Hello? So 
So you like the flowers? You have to stop this. This is insane. What's insane is how you broke up with me three years ago, and then you move here to start a new life with someone else. I didn't intend for anything to happen. I just found someone and I love him. Look, you- Girl, don't be explaining to him. Hang up that phone and call the police. Why are you even having a conversation? Obviously, this man is deranged. Why try to have a conversation with him? Look, you know I came here for you. How did you even find me? Okay, I spent months watching your Instagram to find out where you are. And by the way, you shouldn't keep your whole life public if you don't want to be found. I don't, um... Found out you moved here. And then, all I had to do was a little bit more research, and I knew exactly where you lived. Look but at him in the bag. You creep! Sure I confirmed it, so I swung by. And then I saw you watering your plants. And eventually, I saw a sad excuse from that. <laughs> so good to be home, sweetie. Hi, <laughs> Bing. I'm going on my run. And that's when I decided that I was going to interrupt one of your runs. Oh my goodness. And luckily, you still love to tell me everything about your life. He's about to leave for a business trip, but uh, I'll let you know. I mean, that just made my life so much easier. And it's all been part of my plan. I plan to get you back. Look, I'm outside. Come out here so we can talk now. I imagine he's like, I set up explosives under the house. And if you don't come on the next five minutes, oh, you're going to perish. Come out here so we can talk now. Come outside. Catch me outside. Girl, you better lock that door. So now you finally decide to lock your door. If you don't leave right now, I'm going to call the cops. You should have called the cops a while ago, babe. You know I'm not scared of anyone. And if I can't have you, then no, no one, one can. can. Imagine that. Imagine the homeless man pulls up and what? Right in the side of his head. If y'all know, y'all know. If you don't know, you gotta go and find out. You gotta go. I knew you were following her, Jason. Fight! 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 The story just didn't add up, so I did some research. You never- Pull it out! Pew pew pop You've been out. stalking her the whole time. And I'm not gonna let you get away with it. Wow, how short is he? He's like really looking up. Oh, oh, there's- there's a- You've been stalking her There's a difference. The so what, Zach? What are you gonna do about it, huh? She loves me. And if I can't have her, you're definitely not getting her. Oh! Yes! Yes! Oh, on the ground. The only thing you're getting is jail time and a restraining order. Carb, stop him! Uh. Oh my gosh, Zach! Hey. How are you even here right now? I thought you left for your business trip. Oh my gosh, it was so scary. He was leaving a bunch of gifts and then he was banging on the door and I couldn't even call the cops. It's okay. It's okay, I got you. You know what I would have done? I, if there is like a window on the second floor, I would have got some knives, went up on the second floor, opened the window, threw them down as hard as I could, just I would never let anything happen to you. When you told me you ran into your ex, I knew something was wrong. So I did some research on him. He's been stalking you for months. I only pretended to go on that business trip to lure him out. But I would never leave you alone. Okay. Come on, Zach. Zachariah. Zachary. The amount of time you've been on the floor, Jason, you could have got up, find the nearest hard object, and just hit him in the back of the head. I'm not trying to give advice to the stalker, but um, that's what I would do if I was in Jason's shoes. Just saying. How could you do this, Jason? I don't want to be with you. I will never want to be with you. I don't love you. I don't want you anywhere near me, this house, or this neighborhood ever again! How could you do this to me, Jenny? You did this to yourself! <laughs> that was so unconvincing. I'll be here to deal with you shortly. But I loved you! What you have isn't love! You have a condition! It's an obsession! Obsession, you that's right, Jenny. Just invade people's privacy and put them in danger and call it love! That's not what love is, Jason! You need help! 
serious help. And I help. seriously hope you get some. Me too, girl. Hmm. Now fade out. Hey, Illumably fam. Thank you for oh, watching Illumably. that video. At Illumably, our mission is to bring light back into the world. You and definitely you, did that. There's there nothing, nothing we can't can do. do. Nothing. Thank you for watching, everyone. Thank I'll you. see you guys in the next video. Oh! I was supposed to say that. Oh, that's so crazy. See you next time. Um, Y'all are so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Whoa, okay, Illumably. It was good. I, you know, they have, um... They, they know what they gotta do and they got it going on, if you know what I'm saying. Anyways, <laughs> that was a very inspirational and amazing story. It goes to show, if you have a stalker... Uh... I don't really know, actually. <laughs> it goes to show, if you want to stalk your ex, don't do it. Move on. For your sake and for hers. Move on. Okay. This was such a great video. I like had so much fun with this. I hope you had fun too. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you like and leave a comment. My social media will be in the description and on the screen. Subscribe today to become a citizen, not only for today, not only for tomorrow, but for forever. Anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching. This has been your girl Doris, and I'll catch you guys next video. See ya. Hello, Doris? <laughs>